as emerging Asian economies such as China and India continue their spectacular growth. Countries across the world are scrambling to gain a stable energy supply, while energy prices continue to swing wildly. That's why such high hopes are being placed on nuclear power. With stepped up actions to combat global warming and protect the environment, nuclear power is being promoted around the globe. Japan's first nuclear power reactor went online in 1963. The country now boasts a history of more than four decades of actively boosting nuclear power, building power stations through the years literally without interruption. The result is that Japan has accumulated a continuous and evolving base of rich expertise in plant design, construction, operation and maintenance. From the dawn of nuclear power in the country, Japan has introduced key technologies from abroad. Thinking long term, it has forged tight links between the power companies, the three main domestic reactor vendors, and supply chains for parts, materials, and services. These days, Japan's state-of-the-art digital control technologies are drawing global attention. Its unbroken construction record, comprehensive skills, and the kind of teamwork based on rich experience and achievements are all special strengths of the country's nuclear industry. Meanwhile, the Japanese steel industry has served as a key engine of the country's post-war growth. The industry's technical skill is highlighted today in such important fields as the construction of nuclear reactor vessels. This high-strength, low-alloy steel, which contains both nickel and magnesium, is one of the most dependable in the world. These highly regarded vessel materials are used in most of Japan's 56 nuclear power plants, as well as in about 170 plants abroad. Special technical expertise is needed to make pumps for nuclear power plants. The requirements are kept quite rigorous in order for the pumps to cope with the flow of hot, high-pressure liquids. This landmark high-pressure drainage pump, manufactured in 1994, was developed for ABWR use in the cutting-edge plants of its day. The outside diameter of 1,560 millimeters made it one of the world's biggest class multi-stage double-case pumps. Valves control the hot high-pressure liquids that are produced in nuclear power plants. This factory produces the valves with a special alloy known as stellite. Experienced craftsmen use the process of lapping, that is, grinding or polishing, to produce stellite metal surfaces on the valves with micro-level precision. These custom-made valves are only possible thanks to the combination of the latest technology with such superb craftsman-like skill. At the same time, the management skills to assemble these dependable high-quality parts and materials into a finished nuclear power plant have been accumulated through the experience, teamwork and constant improvements built up over Japan's unbroken construction record since the early 1960s. This outstanding know-how is crystallized in the efficient application of rapidly evolving 3D computer-aided design used in blueprints, precise construction processes, and fine coordination between all of the companies involved.
When nuclear power plants are constructed, the housing and other large sections are assembled as modules in the factory for the most efficient installation on site. Constant use of the latest technologies has fostered the management abilities to get the work done on time, on budget. Japan has also established thorough service systems for the operation and maintenance of nuclear power plants now in operation. Those systems provide each plant with safe and dependable long-term support. In such an earthquake-prone country as Japan, the nuclear power plants need to be made especially quake-resistant. All the operating reactors at TEPCO's Kashiwazaki Kariwa nuclear power site along the Sea of Japan coast were shut down safely in a giant earthquake that struck in July 2007. Important lessons were learned from that experience and the plant's operation is gradually being restored, made even safer than before. The lessons of the earthquake have also been reflected in the earthquake resistance standards of the IAEA, the International Atomic Energy Agency. Japan also places great importance on the manpower training that is vital to create and maintain outstanding technology. Education and training are provided by each power utility and manufacturer. Many trainees also come from other countries, as Japan is eager to make an international contribution to the growth of nuclear power technology worldwide. Japan, as a non-nuclear weapon state, restricts the use of nuclear technology strictly for peaceful ends. Japan also promotes use of the closed nuclear fuel cycle, in which all the spent nuclear fuel is reprocessed. Japan's production technologies for nuclear fuel manufacturing prove their excellence by their extremely low fuel leakage rate. As a peaceful user of nuclear power, Japan abides by all IAEA safeguards and has a distinguished record in the field. Since the early 60s, Japanese industry has acquired the craftsmanship needed to create high quality products. In that sense, Japanese utilities have been constructing nuclear power plants steadily for nearly 50 years, and the nuclear industry has refined the capability to construct them on time and on budget. Assuring safety is most important for promoting nuclear power generation. The highest priority has always been placed on it. I believe that these efforts and achievements are recognized all over the world. I sincerely hope that our high technological ability will contribute to global nuclear power development. For this purpose, the key is that we have to listen to what the partner country wants and that we propose the solutions that will match their requirements. The world currently faces massive energy and environmental challenges. As one solution, nuclear power is sure to play an ever-growing role in the future. Japan boasts a wealth of experience and numerous achievements in the field of nuclear power. It is eager to contribute its advanced technologies and manpower training capability to the further advance of nuclear power worldwide.